summertime because you can't hire them. You don't, you don't have enough money for um, people who are homeless or almost homeless. So all these things happen because you save money. Well, you're not saving anybody any money because in the long run, it's going to cost you more money and it's going to cost lives. You said that uh, you, last year you were more subtle. Why were you more direct to the mayor this year? Because I've gotten sick and tired of being subtle and then nothing happening. So I told him that, you know, this is it. And I hope he's not here next year. I think he needs to hear that because he keeps hearing, oh, yeah, da, da, da. And I don't know if he even heard me last year. And can you spell us your first and last name? Please? First name Mary, M-A-R-Y, last name Hines, H-Y-N-E-S. And uh, how would you do it? Can you tell us a little bit about, I know you, of course, from around City Hall, but can you tell us a little bit about your, yourself, uh, what you do, or, or where you live? I'm or? basically retired. Mm -hmm. um, I was a, a teacher for 35 years or so. Here in Toronto? Uh, in Toronto, over 25 years in Scarborough. Okay. And um, I do supply teaching now here and there. Yeah. I'm very active with the Older Women's Network, which is an advocacy organization for midlife and older women. Um, I'm also uh, on a committee at North York General Hospital, a patient advisory committee. I uh, keep active politically, keeping my, you know, aware of things. I run for office a few times. And which office is it? I ran for uh, MPP once, uh, federally twice, and school trustee once. And what, what part of town are you in? I'm in uh, the Don Mills area, Don, Mill, Don Valley West, uh, Don Valley East. Okay, great. Thanks very much. Mike. You're welcome.